well guys, it's a bit of a sad day. I'm in that little Panda 100 HP Sport that I did all that work to and recovered from the living dead. And I'm just about to go and pick a lad up from the um, train station who's buying it. It's a cracking little car, I'll say. I'd, I'd have liked to have kept this. It's a little rocket. But you wouldn't believe the difficulty like trying to sell it because of the high mileage everyone put off but the amount of work you see it's like new car all drives lovely fast anyway let's go into a new home and we've got a new little uh, surprise 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 still the blacks before your eyes yeah Bye bye little Panda Sport. I've put about nearly 2,000 miles on it since I've done all the work and MOT'd it. And it's been faultless. And it's good on fuel. I tell ya. Good little car. Good little car. Smoother than my yellow one. Faster than my yellow one. About the same fuel as my yellow one. Apart from it's not four wheel drive, so. It'll soon get wrecked if I was doing bees with this, wouldn't it? But yeah, it's a lovely little car. So that's what's happening. It's gone bye-bye. Bye-bye, little panda. I wonder if I cry like the boy I bought it off. When it, when it went on the lorry and got took away, he had a tear in his eye. And I can see why now. You, can, you, you drive one of these pandas, you, you soon think, God, right, they're reliable economical and they just put a grin on your face smiles per miles just not big enough so yeah anyway shut up man then I need to check bees because I caught a swarm swarm on the shed swarm on the shed let's hope it's not my bees